Hi guys, um, today we're going to be doing some course fishing in Perthshire in Scotland. Um, basically I've just made up some ground bait, we've got uh, frenzied hemp seeds, ground bait, we mixed that up with some sweet corn and maggots, uh, and some krill pellets, and uh, we're basically just going to chip bomb that out into one area. Uh, I've never fished here before, I've no idea if I'm in the right spot or not, um, but we're just going to give it a go. Um, bait that out, cast out a couple rods, um, put them on bite alarms and hopefully hopefully we get something. Um, I'm hoping for tench or bream, uh, ideally tench. Um, so well, yeah, we'll see, we'll see what happens. Not a good sign. So I've moved up, uh, it was too weedy down there, so we're now next to this tree. Um, I'm not going to put too much bait out straight away, I'm going to have a couple of casts and see how much weed I'm pulling in. Um, I would move further up but there's a guy in that corner up there, so um, we're going to have a, a couple of casts first and uh, see if it's looking any better. <laughs> there we go. Is that a rod? It's very bronze. Not very familiar with my core species. But I'll put them back. Nah, he's away. Whatever this is, it's a bit better. Oh, it's buried in the weed. It's putting a lot of pressure to get it out. I think this might be what we're after.
That's what we came for. Lovely tench. Definitely the biggest I've caught. Let's get him back. <laughs> well, we got one. We finally got a tench. Uh, lovely fish. Um, I really had to bully it quite hard though to get it through the weed. Um, so I'm just checking my lines okay uh, and we'll get it back out there. But I'm uh, more than happy with that. Um, good fight as well. I feel like people much prefer the tench to to any bream or anything like that. There's a lot of bream in here as well. I wouldn't mind getting one, uh, since course fish isn't something I normally catch at all. But uh, yeah, that was a success. Um, awesome, see if we can get something else. There. Oh, there's just so much weed there. Oh, it's a big perch. <laughs> it's been a right mixed species day. There you go. Nice wee perch. Scam back. So that's another three maggots on there on the point on the hook and a feeder full. It's been the maggots that have caught the fish every time. I should probably switch the other rod over, but then it might be too hectic. I was screaming. Oh, I just get buried in this weed. My hands. This must be a tench, I guess, because that. You can tell me. Oh. Well, I've now lost two quite good fish and great runs in the weeds, so I've turned my drag up slightly. Hopefully that'll help me bully them a bit more, because they're just burying straight down and then just pulling the hook out. Obviously they're barbless, so any pressure on the line the other way from their mouth is just coming straight out. So uh, that last one felt definitely bigger in the, the tent I caught, but at least, I've, at least I've caught one. I can't really complain, but uh, hopefully there's, there's more to come. Another nice, what I think is a rod. 
correct me if I'm wrong. At this point, the fishing had slowed down to a near stop. Um, a few hours had passed since my last runs, and I think really what was happening was I'd managed to bring quite a lot of fish into the swim earlier, uh, so I was getting pretty constant bites. Um, but as I said, a few hours and nothing. Uh, I could see fish rolling about on the surface, uh, but they were all very small. But uh, after giving up on getting bites on the feeder rods, I decided to have a go for them. So... I can see a few f fish rolling about on the surface um, but I won't be able to cast very far with uh, the normal floats I use so I'm going to try a big bubble float that's all I had in my bag that would cast the distance so size 14 hooks and a few maggots Bite straight away. There's a bite again. There we go. There you go. There's a decent sized fish out there. So yeah, I think we're going to call it there. Um, I've been here for quite a long time and it's the fish has just gone quiet. I'm sure it'll pick up this evening, but I don't want to stay that long really because um, it doesn't get dark till quite late now. So um, we're going to get this stuff packed up and, and head off. But uh, the lock's been good. Uh, had that great tench, um, so I can't really complain. Um, and plenty, plenty we kind of rod in that to keep us busy um, when the fish weren't biting. So um, yeah, it's been it's been good fun. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, and catch you later.